children how are you all fine and lockdown <laughs> now you all must have been habituated in this lockdown you've now started a routine getting up early or late watching drama and having your breakfast this way the day goes on watching tv doing some studies and all isn't it so you know we have started this talking to you i am jhumpa madam uh, i'll do some talking because uh, we are missing you all uh, we cannot meet now na you when you uh, cannot go outside your home we have to do our work from home only so we are working and uh, as we can go outside we stand in our balcony we stand in our veranda and see outside you can see plants around us animals moving out isn't it some people very few people coming out of the home because it's a lockdown and we stay at home only and so uh, when you go to the balcony and see around you see many plants around you today we will discuss something about the plants you see so this is plant kingdom um what we know about the plant kingdom there are many types of plants we have trees shrubs herbs climbers creepers we will study about this now we will discuss um uh, you know what are trees you see the big plants around us are trees uh, like what are trees trees are big tall and strong plants are called trees they have thick very thick strong trunk and leaves this way like uh, the examples of big trees are mango tree peepal tree ashok tree neem tree these are all big trees so this is your task children uh, whatever you can see from your house you make a note of them or you can remember or you can do your uh, little memory again that the trees that you know you have seen you take the help of your friends and write down the name of few trees i'll be giving you the assignment also name few trees which you see around you okay then we have a uh, mango tree and these all things you know we find around our house but when you go to the hill station or some cold places you will find pine trees they're different the snow falls on it and it throws it away when you have coconut trees uh, we eat coco we drink coconut water we eat coconut these type of trees are found in seashore like the places which are near sea then we have cactus cactus is something we find in the desert area has thorns on it so we find it in the desert area then we will go to shrubs what are shrubs shrubs are small to medium sized woody plants and grow up to 5 to 6 meters they are smaller than trees they have thin brown woody stems and also called bushes ha huh. see you know uh, there is a very beautiful white plant uh, flower uh, it comes in sama juhi uh, probably it's juhi or bailey baleful that is uh, jasmine and you know cotton uh, cotton plants are also there white cotton is coming up the clothes which we wear of cotton are made up of this cotton plants and then you know, it's very common plant is rose plant you can see it everywhere these are shrubs these are not very big they are 5 to 6 meters long and just now i told you the definition of it then we have herbs what are herbs herbs are very small and weak plants they have thin green and soft stems they live for 3 to 4 months you see what are the examples of herbs like palak spinach mint tulsi now i'll explain you herbs are something most of them we eat they are very small 
small and like uh, very soft and we eat palak paneer. This is a herb. Then mint mince pudina. Very fragrant. We make chutneys out of that and we eat that. That's very tasty. That's mint. And tulsi, you know, everybody has a tulsi at home. And we worship tulsi and we use the leaves of tulsi for medicine. Nowadays they say to protect yourself from corona, you should use tulsi as well. Okay, so these are the herbs. Then there are climbers. Climbers are plants with weak stems. They cannot stand and need a support to grow. Like uh, you give us support of a stick or something. So they can climb up. So they climb with the help. So they are known as climbers. Very common climber. I'm showing you one climber, real climber. This type of plants are known as climbers. They take the help. And then you have uh, money plant and then grapevine. These are very common climbers. Okay. And you find it around your house many. Next we have creepers. You see, this is a very interesting, very interesting plant, creepers. They are very weak plants. And they creep on the ground and grow. Even if you give a stick to them, na, they will not be able to climb up. They will always uh, move on the ground. You have that uh, pumpkin, famous pumpkin creeper. You have that story of what? Cinderella, the pumpkin changing into a carriage. So these are creepers. Next we will discuss, uh, this is a typical plant. You see, this is the plant. What are the parts of plant? First of all, the plants, uh, they are all living things. They can make their own food. They are not like us. They depend upon themselves only. They, de they don't depend upon any other. So they have root system. These are the roots which you find below the ground. You cannot see them. They, what they do, they take water, mineral and everything from this root and they pass it above. And the stem is like, this is the stem. This is like a pipe, pipeline. It is supplied, this food, everything is going on, going on and they reach up. Then they have the leaves. You know what are the leaves? The leaves are nothing but kitchen. They cook food for the whole plant. This water, sunlight, minerals they are taking in the leaves and they make food for the whole plant. Now the plant eats its own food and it grows and it becomes very happy. Then flowers come up. Before that, flower they have buds and then the bud grows into a grows into a flower and this flower later on turns into a fruit and we eat the fruit you see this way a plant the parts of the plant we have seen so plants are so useful to us you know we eat the plants parts and we use it in our daily life you know how you see now we will discuss uses of plants Plants give us food, like we get fruits, vegetables and crops. What are crops? You know, the farmers, they grow crops first. We eat rice, dal, roti. These all are coming from crops. And nowadays we are living on that only. We are not going to market. We are storing our grains in our home and we are eating every day those things, isn't it? So it's very important and all we get from plants. Then we have useful things like we get from plants are rubber, like tires you see, the car tires and all they are made up of rubber, we get it from plants. Then we have gum and we have different medicines. This is very interesting. We get so many medicines from plants, you know. Uh, sometimes you have a tummy ache, you take Pudinhara, isn't it? So it is again coming from this mint pudina. You see, it comes from the medicine. And tulsi also is a medicine. We get medicine from tulsi also. Then we have uh, the famous medicine, you know, nowadays it's very much in demand. Every country is asking for it from India. 
they are thinking it is the medicine of corona they are using it as a medicine of corona that is hydroxychloroquine and that also comes from a plant you know that syncona is a plant and we get the medicine from that plant so you see we get medicines that we have different perfumes coming from plants they are known as ethra and they are very expensive you don't normally get them in the market they are very expensive and they are the pure perfumes coming from flowers ah, and we rarely get them in the market they are very expensive and very rare but very good those are ethra they are perfumes then we have household things like you see the bed on which you are sleeping it is made up of coir and what is coir you know it is the husk of coconut the coconut when there is a full coconut when they tear it out to get the fruit there are coirs inside it so that coir from that coir we make mattress and we have you know jharu we use the jharu full jharu in our home they are also made from plants and then we have rugs the rugs and carpets which we lay on our house decorate our house different things are made up of jute jute bags you see the jute bags we are using we go to market we take the vegetable and everything the jute bags the jute also come from plants so you see so many useful things we get from plants so children i think uh, you can watch this video twice or thrice to get all the things i have told you about everything and now i'll be giving you some assignments and one task for you you know when you come back to school in the lockdown when we meet everybody bring us small plant like you see i have plant this is my plant you have plant a small creeper whatever you want any plant make it your plant water it every day and take care of that plant a small plant you make for yourself and the day when we will meet after lockdown See, I would like to see your plant, everybody's plant. Of course, I think you will do it for me. That's your little task. Huh? Have your own plant at home. Keep it with you. Water it every day. Show sunlight. Keep it in the balcony. And talk to that plant. Okay? So children, bye. We'll get on based on this chapter. Okay?